So Nathan, just had your debut uh, appearance in, for Bath Rugby. Um, could have gone any better today? Uh, oh, look, there's always things you can work on, but to come away with the win, um, I know the boys uh, were so disappointed after last week's performance and with a short turnaround. And today, I think we showed, you know, what, what potential we do have. Um, obviously, that wasn't a perfect match by any by any means, but the way the boys um, adapted on the run and dug deep against a, a quality French side, um, something you probably they're probably not used to playing every, each and every week. So. Um, yeah, I, I absolutely love to look around now. Just the spot I'm in, it's, uh, it's surreal. So, um, yeah, it's fantastic. We thought we were going to be another hooker down when, when you took a knock there at the end. Uh, how are you feeling after that? You doing all right? Oh, yeah, a little bit little bit uh, battered, but, um, you know, that's part of the game. Um, probably should never have my back towards uh, big Frenchmen, so um, got me a good one there, so I'll, 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 I'll be right. And uh, that means we've got a semi-final coming up in the Challenge Cup. How much, what is that going to mean to the team? Um, oh, I mean, this is this is very different to what I've been ex uh, been exposed to before. Obviously, I've had my time in France, but um, going from competition to competition, you have to refocus. There's different challenges and stuff like that. But I mean, to progress through to a semi-final in, in any competition is a, is a major feat, and I think credit due to the Bath coaches, the Bath players, and um, and even the crowd. I think you can hear them now. So unbelievable. Yeah, you can hear. It was a good vocal crowd today. Was that something that made it easier for you out on the field? Oh, it's always nice playing at home. My first time actually at the rec, so um, unbelievable. I'm just, like I said before, I'm, I'm, I'm just, uh, a real, it's a real surreal moment for me. And just as you start, uh, we've been talking about needing to play more attacking rugby, and uh, certainly it was attacking rugby. Is that something that's been evident for you just coming into the club and um, just started training and getting involved? A hundred percent. I think uh, with, with, the, with the coaching they have here, um, you can really see it in training, and then the quality of players, it just suits them down to a tee. Um, I won't name any names, it's a, it's a collective effort, but um, you know everyone here can play that game plan and I think that's where we sort of got the edge on them today. We, we made sure we ran them around and controlled that ball and um, put them in the back foot. I, I, I do think um, a, a point we've got to exit a little bit better, we put ourselves under a bit of pressure um, at times in the game there and we, we let them into the game. But apart from that, um, I think the boys really stuck to the game plan a lot better this week.